Hey guys, it's your player mad mook right here in scum, and it's Friday. Bonus Friday. All right, and uh, yeah, we're going to be getting out of the weapon torpedo factory that we left off in the last episode. That place is so massive, and the gear is so great. Now, there's a couple other couple of places I want to check out in that place, uh, so come along with me for the next hour. Man Mook's got you entertained. All right, let's get cracking. All right, so we are right in here. Oh, hey, oh, there. Looks like there might be a box of 45 ACP rounds. Actually, let's just... Yeah, perfect. Look at that. Spawned in a full box of ammunition and a gold 1911. All we need is a magazine. Got a cleaning kit to make this gun. Perfect. All right, so we're going to keep an eye open for M1911 magazines. Why is my hat off? Look that. All right. And there's also a 22. Hunter 22. I'm going to drop this bobby pin box. It only has 17 in it, and I'm going to take the 20 of 20. All right. Uh, oh, yes. Right where we left off last or just Tuesday. All right, I don't think I want to go in the building yet. I want to go down that, like, that row there. And uh, see what we can find there. What's this? If there's anything good. In here. Hey, there's a toolbox. Put that there. Actually, don't... I have a... Oh... I lost that bag. I don't remember what I did with that bag. That's a bummer. Oh well. We dropped that bag. I don't know what happened to it or where I put it. It's obviously gone now. Magnifying glass. No, thank you. The scalpel and a disposable mask. No. Bird shot, 22. No items found. Nothing. Nothing. Starting to wonder if maybe someone's already come through here today. Alright, so guys, got some paper, some rags. I'm gonna take the rags, nails, a rag strip. I'll take the rag strip. All right. Hey, that's a good find. Vance lock pick, perfect. Another rag and a disposable mask. No, thank you. Uh, some. Oh, it's a box of bird shot. I'm gonna leave it. Man, I wish there was a boat. Be kind of cool. I definitely want to get over there because I know I found a lot of stuff over there. Actually, you know what? I think that's where I'm just going to head over there right now. I mean, this building over there is good because there's two of them. They're identical. They're good to get into. There's a lot of stuff in them for sure. No doubt. But, uh... I think I'm going to focus on getting over there. Check these as we go. Some more rags. I'll definitely take that. You probably can't even see me. Maybe. No, he can't see me. What you gonna do about it? Uh, actually, I'm not gonna be stupid. We'll move a little bit. Okay, so we got the M MK18 suppressor. That's awesome. Purple smoke. Bird shot, another... Oh, that's AKSU. 7-4-U. Magazine, I'll take that. And I'll take the box of 22. It's a full box. It's hard to pass that up. Um, some slug shots, which I have quite a few. I got... Yeah, I got 28 slug shots and a flare. I'm going to leave that. Hey, it's an anti-personnel mine. I'm gonna leave that. Uh, nine millimeter. I'll take that. We do have the MP5 magazine. We can throw that 
nine millimeter ammo into. Check this out right quick. Hey, some more nine millimeter tracer. Don't mind if I do. All right. All right, working our way around. Some boonie hats. Some 45 ACP rounds. That's pretty cool. More 45 ACP rounds. Boonie hat. Gunpowder and uh, scout knife. Don't need that. More 9mm ammo. That's just regular 9mm ammo. Uh, let's go check it down here. M9 magazine. That's cool. I'll take that. And some 9mm armor piercing rounds. Perfect. Razor blade, disposable mask. I'm very thirsty. Scrap metal. Uh, I think I have. Oh. Ooh. I have one drink left in my canteen. One drink. That's all I got left. Well, I got the. I got grapefruit juice, but that is all I have in my canteen. I wonder, can I fill this up with grapefruit juice? Look at that, I can fill it 100%. <laughs> I can fill it with the grapefruit juice. Grapefruit soft drink. What was, what was that? Is that five now? Three. Uh, might as well put that down. It's empty now. Scrap metal, safety pin, and some thread. I don't need any of that. Uh, what is that? 44. Ooh. 44. The 44 ammunition box. You know what? That's pretty cool looking. Different looking box. Some bird shot. Buck shot. Uh, oh no. Who saw me? Must be that mech over there. Yep. Yeah, he saw me. I was memorized by the bird of the, uh, Ammunition box for the 44 Magnum. I think over in the SUV, I have a box of 44 ammo or a 44 Magnum revolver. Let's we'll check this box while he's uh, not paying attention. Hey, it's a fishing reel. I'm gonna leave that. Let's uh, get over here. Doesn't appear I can get over that way on this side. and definitely don't want to go in the water. I definitely can't climb it. All right. We'll have to check this container out here though. Nothing found. All right. Dude's feeling tired. So let's look at my metabolism. Yeah, my water's low. Man, my lot is low. Cheeseburger. I still have that cheeseburger MRE in my system. Whole bunch of torpedoes. Some buckshot. I'm going to leave that as I don't need it. Nothing. Hey, there's another holster and some combat boots. I'm gonna leave those. What color is that? Let's get green color, I guess. Maybe digital print or something. Hey, who's left the torpedoes just laying around here? Another M9 magazine. I'm gonna leave that. I'm. I'm a little frustrated that I 
lost my bag that I was carrying. A little bit of a bummer. Here we got some motorcycle boots and a boonie hat. There's a puppet over there. He did. I woke up with some puppets. Oh, that is a bomb puppet right there. I missed. I'm hearing bomb puppets everywhere here. Still hearing another bomb puppet. Hearing the laugh. Don't hear a beep though. Brass knuckles. He did. There's a bomb puppy. He's on the other side of that door. As long as he's stuck out there, I don't care. Brass knuckles. You know, a bomb puppet in where there's torpedoes. Oh, there he went. Hey, we got five by five, six ammo tracer, nine millimeter ammo. Back that up. And a boonie hat. I do have the MP5 on my, on my back that I found. Uh, I do have one magazine for it. I could probably bring that online. Mm, Boonie hat. Uh, oh man, another holster. Don't have the room for it. Don't have the room for it. Another holster. Holster and uh, what else was in there? Boonie hat and a flare. He did. Let's actually get first person. Quickly. Two to the chest. Nothing. Nothing. Scarf. And uh, where's my. Where's that red scarf I had? Man, it's gone. Head sack and a scarf. <clears throat> I think I put that in the red bag. Or my bag I was carrying. A military shirt, I'll take that. Oh, that's right, they're all grouped together. That was a hat left in there. Oh, hey, there's a puppet right there. He did. Hey, my handgun skill went up. Perfect. Oh. Oh, hello. Quickly. Quickly. There we go. All right. I haven't had experience with a, uh, with a malfunction on the revolver. I mean, the revolver is pretty, pretty reliable. I have a box of a uh, buck a shot. I'll take that. So I'm curious what kind of jams or or malfunctions they're gonna have with the revolver. Kind of looking forward to seeing what that's like. A beanie. I'm guessing maybe uh, some cylinder problems. Maybe the cil cylinder doesn't latch in. A nine nine and a scarf. I'm gonna leave that. We'll get up into these offices because I'm hoping that maybe there's a way of getting water up there. More 9mm ammo. You know what? I'm actually, what I'm going to do is I'm going to take this ammo and load up this MP5 magazine. Fill it up. I wonder if they're going to bring in like a speed loader or something. That would be kind of cool. 
There we go. That, M that MP5 magazine is fully loaded. Take this MP5 and uh, get that thing loaded up. There we go. All right, so we got the MP5. All right, so we definitely do not want full auto. No, uh, three shot burst, I don't want that either. There we go, single shot, perfect. All right. All right. Hello. Did Hey, 19 or M1911 magazine. Perfect. Cuz we got an M1911, a gold one. All right. Let's pop in seven rounds of that. Big 45 ACP. All right, that's fully loaded. Throw that down here. Bring this gun into my hand. Reload that. There we go. There we go. It's actually we could repair that cuz we got the uh, repair kit. Or the uh, cleaning kit. There we go. Nice, shiny, clean looking. Alright. What's wrong with my uh, can opener there? Alright, put that there. Alright, my dude's dehydrated. Let's uh, get a drink of my grapefruit juice. Yum, yum, yum. All right, let's go back to searching. Hopefully we can find some water, a uh, military helmet. I don't want that. Uh, hey, another M M1911 magazine. Uh, we could put, we could fill them up, but uh, I'm actually just gonna just carry it for now. Another head sack. Yeah, that's right, these are kind of weird. Nothing. Uh, it doesn't look like there's any uh, weapon lockers anywhere. Hey, it's a fanny pack or waste bag. Don't make fun of my fanny pack and don't be jealous. <laughs> All right. That's awesome. That gives us some some uh, waste bag space. That's awesome. I have three shots of 7.62 by 39 AK round. I don't want that. All right now, metal detector. And that could come in handy, but I just don't want it right now. Check this out. And it's 7x6, 2x5, 4. I don't want that. Not right now. Alright. I don't know if I checked these over here. I think I did. Pretty sure I did because there's a dead puppet there. But no, I guess I did not. M9 magazine. Uh, no, don't want that. Hey, we're out here by this place. We don't come back. I'm going to go check that office first. Check this one. Yeah. At. What's that? Nothing. Some buckshot. A scarf. Nothing. <laughs> Alright, let's get up in this office. Hopefully, there's something good in there. Alright. My uh, vending machines. A uh, head sack. What's with the head sacks for some reason? Scrap metal. Bolts. Padlock. Beanie. Scrap metal. Wire. Scrap metal. Last but not least, rubber band. All right. Safety pin, no. Magnifying glass, I don't think I'm gonna find anything of value in here. A couple padlocks, I guess if I was looking for padlocks, I have a lot. All right. Oh, there's a bathroom in here. Scrap metal, too bad we can't get uh, Hey, that's a good find right there. Emergency pack or emergency bandage pack with along with the safety pin. 
That is awesome find. I'm actually, actually happy we found that. It's four or five, but uh, it's four emergency bandages in there. Perfect. All right, safe pin, razor blade. All right, we seriously need to find water. Or I need to get to drinking. Uh, all right, all right. Drinking my uh, grapefruit juice. Drink that up the rest of the way. No, it is not. Well, it comes up as a soft drink. But, I mean, I, I'm sh sure it gives you some hydration. And, of course, if you were dying of thirst and all you had was a pop can sitting around, I'm sure you would drink it. All right. Open for a vending machine or a water bottle thing. Oh, yes. This right here. Oh, man. Empty. Are these glasses? Sunglasses. Ah, take them. You never know. All right. So we got rubber band, duct tape, and some safety glasses. Or, no. It wasn't safety glasses. Safety pin. <laughs> All right. Well... Kind of thinking we better start hurrying up a little bit because uh, a hat, duct tape, flare. I'm definitely, there's a couple things I want to check yet. MP5 magazine, I'm taking that. Definitely want to check out a couple things. I don't want to die of thirst. Kind of really disappointed that uh, there was no water in that one jug. All right. So we are, where are we at? All right, so we gotta go out this way, I think. Yes, all right. Fingers crossed we can find some goodies over here. So that's a hat or a scarf, nothing. Uh, definitely don't wanna go in there. Carrying my, my uh, canteen around just in case, you know, you never know. Might be a water drop that might jump out in front of us or something. All right, we got the MP5 ready to go. Ooh, ooh, ooh. I hear a bomb puppet somewhere. That's a safety pin. Shirkin. Some matches. Oh, where you at? It's not a bomb puppet, but I'll kill it. There you are. Kablooey. All right, check this one. Uh, scrap metal padlock, razor blade, and a safety pin. Construction gloves. Head hat, or head head sack. Small screwdriver, I'm gonna leave that. A pen, I don't need that. A boonie hat, two boonie hats, a scarf, gun or gun, ah, gunpowder, and uh, shotgun shells, buckshot. All right. Kind of weird that there's a dock there. I wonder if there's like a World War II bunker over there. We had a boat. We would check it out. Unfortunately, we do not have a boat. Okay, that's right. These things. It's easy to fall through and get in the water and be in a world of mess in this area. 45 ACP rounds, another grenade. You know, I'm gonna take that. I'm taking the grenade. There's another bomb puppet somewhere? Two? I wonder if he's up here above my head. Yeah, I think he's up above my head. Oh no, he's laying right there on the ground. <laughs> oh, he flicked in the air. Is that another bomb puppet over there? Ha! It was. The three bomb puppets just in this little spot. He should be going pretty soon here. Heads down. There it went. Still have another one yet. 
It's like the bomb puppet hangout. Hat. Where went that guy? This one must have died from that other bomb puppet. Oh, hey, there's a sewing kit. Those are worth their weight in gold now. Some scrap metal and a metal pipe. All right. Shirt, head sack. You know, I can hear something breathing. Can I put this ghillie suit or weapon ghillie suit? Oh, it's actually bigger than I thought. Put that on the. Uh... No. I'll keep that for the M1 whenever we get one. All right, so we're actually kind of done with this area. Let's actually go up this ladder here. Get on the ladder the right way. No, oh, great. I was too far over. Don't fall in the water. I'm gonna have to kill this one. Um, hurry up. <laughs> oh, he jumped. He jumped and did not go in the water. So he should be alive. I'm gonna have to make quick work with the MP5 up here. He did. There's another one up inside that door. He's fine though. They're inside the door, no problem. Check our ammo load. Eight rounds. Plus a fully loaded revolver. Alright. Doesn't look like anything in there. Hey, we got a couple lock weapon lockers up here. Sweet. Alright. Lighter. Padlock. Rubber band. A whole bunch of lockers there. Some scrap metal. More scrap metal. Harmonica. Scrap metal. Some paper. And some nails. Alright. We'll come back for these. We got, uh, what, three of them? We really need to get water. Seriously, need to get water. Oh, there's more locked containers up here. You down? He down. All right, we should only have, I think, two rounds. Four rounds. Miscounted. Hey, what's this? The block. Block twenty-one. Scrap metal and a wire. A battery with two two power in it. <laughs> Scrap metal and wire. And all right, we got three of those locked containers. Man, I'm losing it. Like all over it right there. All right, perfect. All right, I'm gonna unlock all these and then come back. There we go. I was gonna break that one. There we go. All right. Ah, oh, 45 ACP rounds. I'll take those. Perfect. 
Uh, 12 gauge or 12 gauge buckshot. Take that as well. Brass knuckles, man. All right, let's go. Go down here. Excuse me, puppets. Right, let's grab these here. Can I close that door? Guess not. Man, I gotta be like right, right there. There we go. There we go. There. Hey, it's Blackhawk. I'm gonna take that crossbow. Perfect. And some 357 armor piercing. I'm gonna take that as well. And an M1911 magazine. All right. Well. Hmm. Make sure this is topped off. We had one, one empty shell. All right. Ooh. Can't go down here too fast. You know what? I'm gonna check these. Ah, scrap metal. And over here. A bunch of stuff. Scrap metal wire. And some thread. Alright. Well, we are hurting on water. We need to find water. Of course, can't use seawater. Dude is dehydrated. I think I might be out of everything to drink. We do have a pop or soda. All right. Um, boom. I didn't litter. I threw it all the way over to the other island. <laughs> or the other... Uh, over there. All right. Get our run on. Hopefully we can find <clears throat> some water. Fingers crossed we find water. I am actually... A, I am a little bit nervous on the water situation. Because it is so critical now. Take this bomb puppet out. He did. Be cool if they all they would all run over to that bomb puppet, puppet because he was making noise. They would all run over to him and then come bluey. That'd be kind of interesting. All right, what do we got in here? Hey, more office stuff. You know. Close that up. Thought I heard something in here. Go upstairs. Man, I was hoping for like a... Yes, one of these things. Yes. Ah, oh, it's empty. A bottle of water? Somebody. Oh, safety pin, magnifying glass, gunpowder, M1911, come on. Paper, no. Scrap metal, no. So we need water. A padlock. Ooh, emergency bandage, I'll take that. Really wish there was water though. I don't think I'll find anything water related. That's safety pin, cigarettes, a lens and plastic scissors, safety pin, padlock, lighter, duct tape. No luck. No luck with the water front. All right. 
All right, let's uh, we're going out the way we came in. I think if I can get back to my SUV, I think there I have some water there. But then again, I'm not 100% sure. All right. Go in here. Oh, hello. <laughs> Oh, that's so cool that they fly like that. Oh, crap, I'm empty. Oh, crap. No bomb puppets. Gotcha. All right. Now I'm bleeding and dehydrated. All right, so we got couple dudes coming over there what not that four rounds oh man that was my last round too oh whoa that would have been bad all right I'm gonna take this time to uh, take this in my hand quick take it in my hand quick oh Run! Punk! Beat you with the MP5! Oh, beat you! Still beating you! Still beating you! I'll switch my knife real quick. Knife, knife, knife! Ooh! Right in the face! Dead. Alright, we are in a world of hurt right now all right that's a c2 that's oh that's i guess water deficiency i can't do nothing with that all right let's uh do this two bandages right now i'm not going to use the uh tourniquet we're not in a situation where we need a tourniquet right now all right uh this one let's do a full bandage on that one there we go I'm actually in a pretty bad situation. I have zero carbs, zero fiber, zero sugar. Saturated fats are through the roof. I still got the cheeseburger in my system, but my stomach's empty. Where the heck's the cheeseburger at? <laughs> All right. Well, that didn't work out very well. Definitely, uh... Hey, another Bushman. I'm gonna leave that. Scrap metal and uh, safety pin. CD player, metal pipe, scrap metal. Uh, I'm actually gonna get down from here. Mainly because I don't have, I don't think we have anything loaded up. All right, come on. All right. All right. So we need to think seriously here. We need to load this up. I just hear another puppet somewhere. Definitely hear a puppet somewhere. All right. That's fully loaded. I'm actually going to take that in my hand. And uh, I'm going to actually put that at number six. Take out the MP5 magazine, top that off, or put ammo in it. That's 45. Alright, there we go. Alright. Airdrop coming in the D4 sector, that's way north. Not good. Uh, I'm not hitting good enough. I'm not good enough. Oh, crap! Um, uh, armor piercing. Uh, yeah, load that up. All right, I think that's all the ammo I got. I don't know where my shotgun is. Um, I had a shotgun. 
It was that pump shotgun. I don't know what happened to it. I really honestly don't know what happened to it. Um, I think we're safe for now. All right, so we went through here. It's a claymore and a tactical jacket. What am I carrying in this tactical jacket? I like the color of this tactical jacket a little bit better than the one I'm carrying or currently wearing. Um, let's actually throw all this stuff in there. Canteen's empty. I got empty magazines. Oh, that's 30 rounds of 9mm. Got plenty of 9mm. Sight. Let's take this jacket off. Let's, let's just now realize that it's... Uh, where can I put this? Right, just drop it. There we go. Put this one on. There we go. Now our outfit. Our outfit is matching our jacket and pants. Kind of cool. All right. Oh, that's a P. What? Huh? P O S P scope. I'm gonna take it. Take it and put it in my shirt. And some wool gloves. And uh, that's a claymore. I already looked at that one. And what is what color is that? Is that like a yeah? That's like the winter color. All right, so I think we can unlock these, and then after these, we're gonna have to get out of here because we are gonna be dying of no water, lack of water. Let's go. There we go. If it was raining, we could use those little makeshift rain collectors unfortunately not raining wow that was an incredibly easy one all right let's take out let's just make a craft a bobby or lock pick out of that guy take out a bobby pin craft here we go and that's how that one is and this one even easier all right 7.62 by 5.4 ammo no as valve magazine i'll take it uh deagle 50 caliber magazine i'm not going to take that some nine millimeter ammo i'll take that five rounds of the 7.62 by 39 we'll leave that another m1911 magazine i'll take that all right, let's actually throw these nine millimeter rounds in this MP5 magazine. All right, I think that might top that one off. Load this gun up, the MP5. All right, so now we're gonna to have to work our way on getting out of here. <clears throat> All right, so we got a walker over there, I think. I think he goes down quite a ways. Pretty sure he does. Pop it there. <laughs> oh. Oh. I don't like this. Don't like this. I don't like this. I don't like this. <laughs> Jace, please, I thought it was all over right there. Oh my god. This ain't good. Oh, oh no. This ain't good at all. Oh man. I died. Oh boy. That was a bad situation. It just got worse. Compiled by everything else going on. Man. We died. That's a bummer. All right, of course we're on respawn in sector. That was kind of weird. I don't know what just happened there. All right. Well, that's uh, that's a stinker. All right. Where are we at? We are way, way south. We gotta go way north. Where are we at? We are. 
And of course, where my body is, is like in the worst, worst spot possible. Because it's right there where the walkers both kind of overlap. So it'll be entertaining to get that. Recover my body there. Of course, I don't have any, any guns or anything, but I might... Actually, I don't even know... I don't think I... I do have my SUV just outside, but I don't think I have anything that is... I know that I, I do have a couple guns, but I don't think their condition is very good. Like, I got the AK-47, but the condition is like 25% or something like that. So it's going to jam all the time. We might just have to use that to recover my, my body. At least we're not worrying about water right now. That I was pretty hard up for water. And I did notice like when I went to aim, it seemed like it was like a lag. It, it seemed like a lag, but I think it was just my my guy was tired and wasn't going, just wasn't moving quickly because he was tired because of the water problem. I'm actually going to craft a knife, so at least I have something to fight with. There we go. Because at least a knife... Any weapon is better than just your bare hands. We're actually making up ground pretty pretty quickly here. Of course, we're running with no no carry weight. So yeah, you can make up you can make you can run pretty good with that. It's starting to get a little bit dark. Harder to see if there's any any sneaking pumpets anywhere. Alright, I'm actually gonna lay down right here. Oops, let's dance. I don't want to dance. Have a nice little lay down. My head's gone. <laughs> My head is all gone. This is a nice little trick. You speed up your uh, stamina recovery by like tenfold easy. All right, let's go. We still need to find some some animal take its hide from and make uh make my rug back at the uh back at my little camp I haven't forgot about that of course if I didn't die then maybe we could have done something with that oh, don't fall down the cliff go actually starting to see it now yeah perfect all right oh huh. that's a little bit of a drop there Yeah, this is a uh, it's a bit of a drop there, but uh, we gotta go down there. Ooh, all right, all right. Where did we go in before? Not exactly sure. Okay, so I died. 
heading out towards the vehicle, so we might as well go in where the vehicle is. And hopefully we find our way. I'm really curious what it's going to be like to uh, recover my body right in probably the worst spot possible. Uh, hopefully I don't die again. Alright, should be coming up in my vehicle pretty soon here. Yep. Alright, perfect. Perfect. Alright. Alright, so inventory. Um... I guess this block actually isn't too bad. It's 74%. Take the block. I'm going to take my knife and put it in here. Although, do I have any magazines for the block? I don't think I do. Hey, we got a couple. Yeah, we got a couple magazines. Perfect. Uh, yeah. That too. I think that's... Okay, so it looks like all we got is one magazine for the block. That's, uh... Kind of a bummer. Actually, let's put that in there first the magazine actually that full that's a fully loaded magazine all right all right make sure that's ready to go and let's uh let's move in all right so he's walking that way all right so my dude is like out there somewhere I see him. My dude's either by that car out there. Oh crap! Oh, well, that one over there. I'm gonna take a bandage just in case. Ah. Shoot all you want. I'm in the safety of this building. Alright, hopefully it's safety in the building. Nothing. Man, uh, I'm not, I'm not going to search everything. I'm just looking real quick. Nothing. Alright, let's, uh, let's get out of here. It is getting dark, so it's hard to see, unfortunately. Hopefully you guys can see a little bit. I do not have night vision. Uh, it's another tactical jacket and M1911 magazine. I'm going to leave all that stuff. There's my body right there. All right. So that's actually not too bad. All right. So I can grab that gear as much as I can. I'm actually going to... Um, I'm actually going to put my block right here. The ammo right next to it, and my bandage here. I don't see any puppets around my body, so... Actually, you know what? I'm going to run out there without my shirt on. <laughs> or my pants. Alright. Feeling slightly chill. I wonder why, because I'm in my underwear. Alright, so when he turns and walks away and kind of heads down that way, hopefully that other one will be kind of walking away too. If we can time it just right, I'll be able to run out there, grab everything, get back in this room area, and be, be good. And get back to the SUV. Alright. He's going that way. Oh crap! Oh crap! I can't believe he didn't shoot. He's probably gonna take time, valuable time, standing there looking. Did I see something? Oh! <laughs> Alright, so their timing is a little weird. Wonder if there's any like smoke bombs or anything in here. 
Uh, can of baked beans. Booney hat. Hat. More 45 ACP rounds. Darn. Just when I was hoping for some gas masks or smoke grenades or something, I didn't find any. Go figure. Alright. Alright, so let's see. Where's the other one at? Alright, so. We'll have to wait for that other one to kind of clear out of the area first. Okay, so he's heading this way. All right, let's move a little bit. Get this one out of the way. There we go. What about this guy? All right, ooh. Okay. So I gotta wait for him to kind of get out of the area. He could easily see me. Okay. Run, 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 run. Run, run. Perch, quick. Quicker. Perch him. Quick, quick, quick. <laughs> grab it. Just grab everything. Go. MP5, black hat. Oh, crap. Jacket, shirt, pants. All right, I'm, I'm done. Oh god, there's, there's two, they're both shooting at me. Oh. Wow, I lived. Wow, that was close. That was close. Dodging bullets the whole way. Plus, I got my uh, Block 21. Ooh, Ooh I should... I gotta get out of here. Whoa. Whoa. <laughs> wow, that was close. That was, that was close. All right, I don't have night vision or a flashlight or anything, so I think I'm going to do what's best and just try to get out of here. Though it's hard to pass up all this stuff. Uh, battery jumper cables, or battery cables. Metal scrap. Uh, muff, or ear, muffins. Uh, 22 caliber ammo, and uh, those are ear muffin muffles. Ear, not ear muffles, ear your muffs there we go could not get that word out of my head all right yeah i'm not gonna look anything else all right whatever dog food it's not it hasn't come to that yet all right well awesome we got uh uh let's just just get out of here Why are you coming over here? Alright, so you're coming over here quite a ways. Alright, so we got back to the SUV. Oh, too bad we lost that bag. That's unfortunate. Let's throw this. Uh, definitely don't need our our, uh, our our shoes. I'll throw that ghillie weapon ghillie suit in there. And uh, ooh, I gotta repair my gotta repair my stuff. Wow, my my waist bag is damaged. <laughs> All right. Oh uh, yeah, repair that as well. I tell you, ever since the uh, zero point six update, you really have to pay attention to your gear you gotta repair it so carrying a sewing kit is essential to your day to day all right let's actually repair my bag all right so i don't know what my condition of everything is um mainly because it's all just tossed around uh yeah we gotta basically rebuild our quick access belt we had a flare and a tourniquet uh, aspirin water but we don't have any water and uh, I don't think we had well, we had a we had a we had a can opener of course I 
guess we might as well throw the M1911 gold in my uh, quick access. All right, so we, we got out of that that uh, torpedo weapon factory. Man, that was so close. I, I did die. That's unfortunate, but uh, man, it was a lot of fun. A lot of fun. And uh, we were able to get our body back and it was close that was uh two of those walkers just kind of overlapping each other their views you know and, and here's my body right in the center and then they're both looking at the same spot that's too bad but uh <laughs> we got my body back and uh got my gear back not necessarily my body but uh yeah this is awesome and uh i i wanted to do a, i wanted to do a lot more stuff today but man, I tell you, just in an hour's time, this game, I mean, it, it feels like maybe it's been 15 minutes and it's well over an hour. But uh, yeah, I am your player, Mad Mook. This is Scum. We are kind of surviving a little bit. And can we died a few times. So I guess the survival aspect is gone. But uh, yeah, I'm your player, Mad Mook. Keep on cracking on.